Good morning, everybody. I'm Mr. David, and this is Friday Storytime at Casson Public Library. Well, Pat did the New Year's story time, so this is the first time I get to say Happy New Year in this new year to you. And it's winter has finally come. And what kind of winter activities do you enjoy? Maybe you like sledding, building snowmen, snow forts. Well, today we're going to talk about Froggy, and he's going to build a snowman. It was cold. Froggy woke up and looked out the window. It's snowing! It's snowing, said Froggy. And today is the winter carnival. Froggy, called his mother. What? It's time to get dressed, dear. This year, you're not sleeping through the winter carnival. Yay, said Froggy, and he imagined the snowman he would make. Super Frog, with a cape hanging from his neck. Then he hopped out of bed and got dressed, and he even remembered to pull on his long underwear. Zap! Zip! Zup! Zut! 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 Zap! And flopped to the kitchen for breakfast. Flop! 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 But Froggy, said Dad, why are you wearing your coat and cap and mittens and scarf? So I don't miss the bus, said Froggy. And he ate his bowl of cereal and flies. Munch, crunch, munch. Then he jumped up and flopped to the school bus. Flop, flop, flop. Have fun, said Mom and Dad. At school, where the Winter Carnival was, Froggy was the first off the bus. Flop, flop, flop. And he was the first to make a snow angel. Zwish, zwish, zwish. Then he started to build a snowman. Froggy, called the principal, Mr. Mugwort. What? First, we're ice skating. Yippee, everybody yelled and raced to put on their ice skates. But Froggy didn't know how to ice skate. He skated like a seasick chicken. Flap, flap. Oops, cried Froggy, falling, falling. And Max and Frogalina fell over him. Zblat, zblat, zblat. Now I'm building a snowman, said Froggy, sitting up. No said Mr. Mugwort. Now we are sledding. Yippee, everybody yelled, and Froggy and his friends raced up the slope with their sleds. But Froggy didn't know how to sled. He zoomed down and smacked into Max. Oops, splat! And they rolled out of their sleds into the snow, laughing like crazy. Now, said Froggy, jumping up, I'm making a snowman. No, said Mr. Mugwort. Now we are making a snow fort. Yippee, everybody yelled. And Froggy and his friends pushed and piled and packed snow into a big snow fort. Cool, said Froggy. Now let's have a snowball fight. Froggy! called Mr. Mugwort. What? Now, said Mr. Mugwort, it's time to build a snowman. Yippee, yelled Froggy, and all his friends yelled with him. And they rolled snow into big balls. Zwoom, zwoom, zwoom. And everyone built a snowman. Max, built a snowman that looked like a beaver chewing on a carrot. Matthew built a snowman that looked like a turtle wearing a ski cap. Travis built a snowman that looked like a bear with mittens instead of claws. And Frogalina built a snowman that looked like Froggy looking goofy. What do you suppose Froggy built? Do you remember what he was going to build? 
Nice, said Mr. Mugwort, looking at all the snowmen. Now let's see what Froggy made. Well, Froggy had planned to build a super frog, but oh no, he'd forgotten to bring his superhero cape. So Froggy built a snowman that looked like a dinosaur with a carrot teeth. Roar, went Froggy, and everybody roared with him. Can you roar with me? Roar! Snowball fight, yelled Froggy, and Froggy made a snowball and threw it at Mr. Mugwort. Thwack! And it smacked him in the chest. Oops, cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. What do you suppose happens when you throw a snowball at the principal? Mr. Mugwort wiped snow off his coat and glared at him. Then he made a snowball and yelled, Let the snowballs fly! Yippee! Everybody yelled. And some ran to the snow fort, some hid behind trees, and the snowballs did fly. Thwack! 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 That was my best winter carnival ever, said Froggy. That was your only winter carnival ever, said Max, and everybody laughed. Even Froggy Snowman, it roared with laughter. Ha ha ha!